Back in October, 2023, I created a simple Christmas light installation website here in St. Louis for a mock company called Christmas Lights of STL. I then did a webinar with JC Chanowski, who's very involved in the Christmas light installation community. And I did a step-by-step -step video, which you'll see here in the comments and description on exactly how I built the website. So that way it would eventually get to the first page of Google. Then I spoke last week at Clipicon and I was able to share some of the results in the case studies of five and a half months of SEO on the website ongoing. It's now on the first page of Google for the main keyword, Christmas light installation St. Louis, and it's already starting to generate leads in the website. So it's really cool to see how this is transformed from inception to case study to now generating leads and have it ready to rock and roll heading into the busy season here in 2024. In this video, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how I built this simple website, how I created a free Google business profile, and then performed SEO on it to get it to rank on page one or the main keyword in just five and a half months. Most Christmas light installation companies treat this business as a side hustle, not just from the mindset behind it, but especially with marketing. They simply add a page to the website of their existing roofing company, pressure washing company, landscape design company, whatever the industry is, instead of building a brand new website and having a specific marketing strategy and plan for Christmas light installation. It's not like roof repair versus roof replacement. This is an entirely different type of service that needs its own marketing strategy, its own website and own plan in order to truly be successful. So the first thing that I did, as you'll see here on the screen, is I went and I found a domain, stlouismochristmaslights.com. Of course, I came up with the name Christmas Lights of STL, very similar to our other company, Autoglass Repair of STL. Our goal with this is to generate leads and partner with a local company this year to be able to do that, but eventually, hopefully generate enough leads to where we could have even start the company ourselves if we actually wanted to do so. I then built the website on WordPress, 20 page website. So homepage, about us page, residential Christmas lighting page, commercial Christmas lighting page, again, to differentiate the two and generate more keywords and traffic into the website. And then I have this area served page. So you'll see all the different suburbs in addition to the city of St. Louis, Missouri that we want to rank for and do business in and then a simple contact us page. So where people go wrong as well is they'll build a simple one page website, landing page, if you will, if they do have a separate website and then they'll expect it to rank and generate all the leads that you're looking for when you really need a 20 page website, for example, to be able to get the leads and the keywords and the traffic that you're looking for. So we have simple call to actions throughout the entire website, especially on mobile but we explain a little bit more about the different services we offer, why we're different, what the process quote unquote is, testimonials, frequently asked questions, et cetera. So this is a perfect example of a website that can be essentially duplicated across any market when it comes to Christmas light installation and be able to have success as long as you're doing continuous search engine optimization. You can't just build the site and expect things to take off. On the back end of the website, this is a tool we use called SEO Minion. There's a variety of different tools out there, but essentially it's just telling us what the title and the description are, as well as the headers and the alt text. So the big key thing is doing research on the average monthly search volume and the difficulty of the specific keyword. What we were able to figure out, and this is one of the many tools that you can use out there. This one's called Search Atlas, it's a phenomenal tool, but I type in Christmas light installation, St. Louis, and that tells us that the keyword difficulty is five, five out of a hundred and it's green. So it means relatively easy, for example, to rank for. The average monthly search volume is 140 times a month throughout the entire year at peak, which is gonna be during Christmas light season is 620. And then you're able to see all the different variations of the keywords, questions that people might ask, et cetera, et cetera. You'll see our Christmas light website on number four, as far as the rankings go, specifically with this from a local standpoint. And those are all the specific things that we've been able to do in order to get this to the first page of Google in a relatively very short period of time. So St. Louis Magazine wrote an article there ahead of us, Outdoor Lights is a national company with really good SEO. And then there's two other organic competitors that are ahead of us. We're coming for those top spots and of course, trying to rank the Google business profile up there as well. But those are some of the things that we've done in order to facilitate optimizing the website. So that way the main keyword that people are searching is first and foremost. And then we just use different variations of other keywords, et cetera, throughout the website. So I would question, my question for you would be right now is as you're watching this video, whether you have a Christmas light installation business and a roofing company, or maybe it's landscaping and pressure washing, doesn't really matter. Do you have separate 
separate websites for those businesses or are they all in one? If you have separate websites, great. I would make sure that you're doing SEO all year round. If you don't, I would make sure to put a plan in place in order to have separate websites this year and beyond. So if you wanna see massive results with this separate website or websites, you can't wait until it's too late for marketing and advertising. Year round search engine optimization is a great way in order to achieve dominance for your Christmas light installation company. So that way you'll be on page one when everyone else is sleeping. People have been asking me, Adam, how did you outrank all these companies and websites that have been doing this for years? It's because it's like going to the gym, they'll go for three months and then take six months off or go for six and whatever it is, right? We're doing year round stuff. So we're doing a daily Google business profile post, super simple and easy. Chat GPT is literally helping us create this entire thing from the picture to the post itself. We're adding more website content, not just from area served pages, but also area served plus a service page, writing blogs, et cetera. We're going out and getting more backlinks. A backlink is simply our website connecting up to somebody else's website, driving traffic back to ours, just shows Google your relevance. And then we're getting citations or directories and listings that are relevant to the industry that match up with the name, address, and phone number of our Google business profile. So we're keeping this super simple and easy. All of the stuff that I just mentioned for you, you could easily do on your own without a marketing company. And those are things that if you do this consistently year round, you're gonna be dominating your Christmas light installation market. So if you're getting value from this video, which I would hope that you are if you're still watching this, there's been a lot of great information specifically on the layout of a Christmas light installation website and the importance behind it. Make sure to hit that like button on the video and subscribe to our channel. Now, the crazy part is, so I'm making this video here in May. In March, we started to get incoming lead flow from both contact forms and phone calls, mainly from commercial, larger types of jobs that quotes are already getting sent out on, but also for people just being proactive after waiting way too late to get quotes this past year in 2023. So we're even starting to get some residential stuff coming in because we're on the first page of Google for main types of keywords and our Google business profiles also being shown in certain areas. So if you don't do SEO year round, you're opening up a large opportunity for you to have to focus and rely solely on paid advertising, word of mouth, and a hope and a prayer that you're going to be able to generate the amount of leads that you're looking for. I was just at this Christmas light installation conference a couple of weeks ago, and people were just saying, hey, we're looking to double our revenue this year. We're looking to do one and a half. They don't really have any plan from a marketing standpoint. They're just hoping that because they did X, this year means X amount of growth, and that's not how it always is. So if you're a Christmas light installation company or contracting company or local service-based business in general, and you're looking to grow with personal branding and organic methods, the first step for you is to join our free Facebook group community if you're looking for some help. You can click it in the description below or just go over to Facebook and type in Builders of Authority and join that. We have daily content, live weekly trainings, and much more inside that community. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below so you can get notified every single time we launch a new video like we did here today. And remember, authority isn't built overnight, it's built over time. We'll see you next time.